Roth. I'm a professional ski guide and ambassador for Backcountry Access. I'm here in beautiful Bariloche, Argentina, and today we're going to introduce some of the tools that we use in our Backcountry Access snow study kit. Probably the first tool we use is the probe, which isn't actually doesn't actually fit in the snow study kit itself but it's definitely an important part. The first thing I've done is I've probed along the slope to make sure that I don't find a particularly shallow part of the snowpack or a particularly deep part of the snowpack, that it represents where I want to ski. So I've probed along, used that probe, and figured out my average depth, and then picked a spot that represents that. Okay, the next tool that I'm going to use is the slope meter. This is a very important part of our snow study kit, something that we might even carry in our pocket during the day. But once we've dug our pit, we need to know how steep it is, if it's representative of the types of slopes that we're going to ski. So to do that, I take my probe, or a ski pole works pretty well. You put it on the slope like this, then you go ahead and set the slope meter on top of that. And you'll be able to read it here. You want to get your head right in line, right down on the snow for this. I've read it already, I know that this slope is 36 degrees, which is uh, really representative of the types of slopes that we're gonna ski today. Okay, so some of the final steps of just getting ourselves set up in our snow pit will be to get our ruler set in place, and you can see the little trick I've got here where I've got it bent over and stuck back in the snow. That's gonna help it stay in place. This, the ruler's important actually because we're going to be doing tests pulling blocks of snow out and we want to be able to measure and know how deep our layers are and if we're recording them and bringing that information to home then that's going to be really important to know the depths and the thicknesses of each layer. Beyond that, I still am using my shovel are really great because they've got a nice flat blade to them and it makes it really easy to clean the pit walls here and get nice flat clean walls which is going to help us when we get results we're going to be able to see them a little bit more easily. 